right, so today I'm going to be doing a haul video, and it's kind of a fashion video as well. So it's a haul video from things that I got from this website called WholesaleDress.net. And what this website is, is a Asian wholesale, Asian fashion wholesale website. So basically it sells Asian fashion clothing. The prices are really, really cheap. They cost like, they range from like uh, one something to like, whatever, like 40 or whatever bucks. So yeah, you can find clothes for like $1 or something. And that's like really, really cheap. So yeah, let me just get onto the haul and I'll tell you guys more about the website later. And the reason why it's also a fashion video is because I'm going to be showing you guys how the clothes look like on. I feel like the clothes that I got are really like just summer basics and essentials that you can really wear with like a lot of pieces in your wardrobe. It's really great pieces for summer and I'm really excited to show you guys what I got and it's just a little small haul. I didn't get that much because I just wanted, you know, the first time to try it out and maybe next time I'll get more started. So the first thing, thing that I got is red skirt and if you guys remember it, this is the same skirt from my outfit of the day video. So here's how it looks. It is a pencil skirt. It has a little ruffle and it looks really pretty. So I really like this skirt and I think bright skirts are a essential piece for the summer just because bright colors are really summery and you can really pair this up with a lot of things and just add color to your outfit. So on the website, this skirt looked coral, but the color did say red. So I guess you gotta have to trust what the color says and not what the picture looks like, which kind of sucks because I was hoping this would be coral, but I like it even though it's red because it's still like a bright colored skirt and that's what I wanted. You guys how this skirt looks like on and what kind of outfits you can pair that with. Okay, so with this red skirt, I wore this um, kind of pink lilac colored button up. So when wearing bright skirts, don't be afraid to pair it up with like different colors. You know, at first I was thinking, oh, you know, maybe I'll just wear this skirt with white or cream, you know, neutral colors. For the summer, color blocking is really like trendy this season. So I just decided to pair it up with this kind of lilac color to make it seem a little more fun and it's always okay to mix up bright colors together. Put it up right here to make it look more fun and casual. You may have remembered from my previous outfit of the day video, um, I just wore this skirt again with a cream colored button up. So this is, I just wanted to show you guys how it looks with a kind of different colored top and different ways you can wear it. I just tied it here because I wanted to give it a more casual feel. This is the next outfit and this is for the more, I guess, daring type because we're color blocking again, but this is with kind of more contrasting colors. And I just wanted to show you guys how this looks because I really like the trend of color blocking. I think it looks really cool. Light uh, turquoise blue top to pair it up with a more lighter color top because if I paired it up with like say a bright blue that might kind of look too much. It's nice to have like one lighter color and one darker color. It just looks really fun and really summery. last outfit with this skirt. It's just a simple t-shirt with this skirt. It really gives it a more kind of casual yet cute vibe in my opinion. This statement necklace. Okay, so the next thing I got is this pair of shorts. And I really love these shorts because really unique. My favorite part is this like laser cut right here that makes it look scalloped and stuff. And when you wear this pair of shorts, it kind of looks like a skirt, but they are shorts. Yep, I love the coral color. It's so pretty and it has a tie 
right here. This coral color short, you can just like pair it up with a lot of things and really add a pop of color to your outfit or to your wardrobe. And this one looks exactly like the picture, so I'm really happy with that. It has a elastic. Here are the shorts on. I just paired it up with a kind of simple um, flowy white top and a gold necklace. You can wear this with a lot of stuff, even just like plain t-shirts and it just kind of dresses up your outfit. If these shorts are so flare, make sure you guys wear something under maybe like a spandex or maybe some shorts under because when you sit down or something or the wind blows, you know, you might be in bad pants. So yeah, just make sure you guys wear something under. The next thing that I got is this pretty crochet vest and I'm sure you guys have been seeing a lot of these around. I really like it and you can just wear this over, you know, like simple dresses, <laughs> simple dresses or shirts or anything to really just dress up your outfit and add some detail to it. And embroidery and stuff like that, embroidery and crochet and stuff like that is really in the summer. And you guys know how much I love my like Lucy embroidery stuff. That's how this vest looks. It kind of goes like, you know, halfway. The crochet top is so detailed. Look at all the detailing on this top. Isn't that cute? Green colored. This one looks exactly like the picture as well. I feel like um, this crochet top is kind of the summer essential or a really great piece to add to your summer wardrobe because, you know, you can really just pair it up with anything. Pair this up with, you know, like tank tops that you feel need a little more or something or dresses or, you know, um, I love wearing this with strapless dresses because sometimes when I'm wearing a strapless, I might feel kind of a little naked up here maybe, so... I just throw this on and it gives me a little more coverage or something. So yeah. I wanted to show you this crochet top with just a tank top and some shorts just to show you a different look. You can wear it. thing I got are these pair of shorts and these are like spandex shorts that you wear under stuff so you can wear this under skirts and my favorite thing to wear this under is shorts because a lot of shorts um, that they make now they're really really short and I don't like it that short so I like to have this to wear just to have some security so that you know when I'm sitting down or anything I don't have to worry about people seeing my underwear scalloped edge so in the picture these shorts, the lace look different. The lace look like bigger, which I wanted, but it turned out to be like this. So I'm probably going to be changing the lace. They fit. They're really stretchy. And I know it may look high-waisted, but really it's not, guys. White, whitish cream colored. All right, guys, so here I'm wearing the lace shorts under these shorts. So... The lace is kind of like peeking out of the shorts, so that's how it looks. I feel like the lace is a little too subtle for me. You wear like undershorts so that you don't flash people, then it's fine. But for me, I kind of want to wear it so that it'll peek out a little just to add some like detail to my shorts. The thing about these though is that when I bend my legs like that or something, like it rolls up and then I have to like pull it back down which is kind of annoying. The thing I got is the black version and this one the lace looks different on this one. This is the kind of lace I wanted on the white one as well but the thing about this 
face is that it's not stretchy. The other one, the lace is actually stretchy. So you can you can fit your thighs in it. It's not stretchy. It's actually restricting your thighs. It looks really, really small because it really is. So this one is a different material as the white one. Way smaller than the white one because of the material and also because the waist is lower. These are just too small. They go like halfway up my butt and that's like all that it goes. I'm super uncomfortable so I do not wear these at all and I'm kind of sad about that because I really wanted black ones as well to wear under my shorts and stuff but it didn't fit so kind of sad about that. When I wear these on to show you guys how it looks, I'm wearing this pair. This is my mom gave me this one. This one, as you can see, is way bigger. The, um, it's way stretchier. The cotton down here is also stretchy compared to this one. This one, as you can see, is way higher waisted and is bigger. So I'm going to be wearing this one in the video to show you guys just how it looks because I can't model these on for you because they're like way too small. Okay guys, so this is how the black lace shorts would look if they had fit, but these are my own. The look of lace kind of like peeking out of your shorts, I think that looks really cute. And also, you won't flash people, which is awesome, because who wants to flash people? But yeah, anyway, I really wish the ones I got from Wholesale Drops fit, because I always like to have like, you know, more than one pair of these kind of like basic slash essential things. Why does the lace look uneven? Alright guys, so that is all to my haul slash fashion video. So let me just talk to you guys a little bit about like the wholesale websites and stuff like that just to give you some info. So for their clothing, they usually come in like one size. And the size is usually like small to medium, but it can really, really range. So they always or most likely provide measurements like of the bust, of the waist, of like the hip and stuff like that. So you can measure if it can fit you. So I think that's really good that they do provide measurements so you know that it'll fit you. And also a warning with wholesale websites is that it can be a gamble because it could be a hit or a miss. Because it's so cheap, you just really gotta be careful. They tell you what material they make it in and stuff, so you gotta see like, oh the picture looks like chiffon but the description says it's cotton. So. Read the description. If it says it's cotton, it's going to be cotton no matter how the picture looks. Yeah, sometimes it just really doesn't look like the picture. So yeah, sometimes the product is not... The picture showing the product is not the actual product that you're going to get. So that's why it can be a hit or a miss to let you guys know that. With WholesaleDress.net, they have a lot of the same items, but like it has the same exact picture but the price is like a little different. So the one that's like, that costs a couple cents more is probably better quality than the one that costs a couple cents less. So you're probably better off getting the one that costs a couple cents more. <laughs> and yeah, like, so with this, this skirt, like even though I really like it and it's really cute, the picture showed a coral colored skirt and it came out red and the description said red. the example of how the picture sometimes is not the thing that you're gonna be getting. The same style as the picture. Another example, like this pair of shorts looked exactly like the picture, which is really good. So this is like a hit, and then this is like kind of like a half miss, like the color didn't look like the picture. And this one, the product looked like the picture, but the quality was just really bad because of the material, like it didn't fit, it was like extremely small, this is probably with a little girl. This cost a couple cents less than the white style of the shorts. So as you can see the white has better material, fits, it has good stretch, um, but the lace is kind of off. So kind of have to like take your chances if you want to. But yeah, I still like ordering from, you know, like wholesale websites just because, you know, they're really cheap and um, the styles are really unique and they're really cute. But yeah, you just got to keep that in mind and I really want to like let you guys know that. Also, wholesale dress, what's nice about it is that you can ask questions like on the product page about the product um, and they answer you in like a day. So 
if you have doubts about it, like, you can ask them. These wholesale websites, I know it's really, really cheap, but keep in mind that the shipping costs a lot. Like, the shipping can cost as much as your clothing. So, when you order the stuff, just know that, you know, in the back of your head, you know, I'm going to have to add shipping to this. And yeah, they ship internationally and stuff like that. My shipping, I picked UPS shipping, and I didn't know that UPS ships from China to US. So it was really, really fast. It took like, like four business days. So I was like pretty impressed. All right, guys. So that is all to my haul slash summer essentials fashion video. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope this helped you out or gave you some inspiration. And don't forget to check out my online store, glamboutique.weebly.com and my boyfriend's online store, monkeysplayground.weebly.com. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!